Howdy, this is uh, Do It Yourself Joe, <laughs> and I'm uh, just showing you a little do it myself here. I don't know if it's going to be any good or not, but what I'm doing is I'm trying to prepare these swarm traps that I made, or bait hives, whatever you call them, and I didn't have any comb things to put in them. So what I did is I, I had some pieces of comb that uh, I had from uh, a, a hive that got... Um, messed up last year with some uh, wax, wax wax moths and uh, so I was able to salvage some pieces of uh, the comb that I thought I could put on some frames and so what I've decided to do is I'm taking some hot beeswax and I'm taking the frames that I made these happen to be lands frames for the bait hives that I made and I'm gonna I have some that have starter strips and so what I've decided to do is make me some starter strips out of this comb and then take the beeswax and uh, take the beeswax and just uh, take the wax and and uh, glue it right onto the bottom of the frame so that uh, it has a starter strip of a uh, comb plus I think it'll make the hive smell better and uh, it'll maybe smell more like home and so the uh, bees may want to uh, they want may want to um, make it home when they when they go to check it out they have this in here so i'm just kind of cutting it and this one doesn't want to cut too easy yeah anyways there we go so we'll take these three pieces and we'll put them along here and what we'll do is we'll glue them in with the uh with the uh wax just like what we did these right here so um, I don't know if it's good or bad uh, maybe those that are more experienced in beekeeping can let me know if they think it'll be uh, some kind of an extra attractant for the uh, swarm traps but um, anyways uh, have a good day and uh, we'll see you next time